Hello everyone and welcome again to Streaming with Steven where we are once again playing Minecraft on the Citadel server and I am going to continue working on the Great Old Temple this evening. So yeah, let's get started, shall we? So last time we got the pillars done, along, well actually the pillars along the front were done, but we finished the ones off the side and then started the started to move back into the the rear end of this. So this is the 32, a 32 by 32 side over here that mirrors the one on the other side. Let's just step back and take a look, shall we? I don't always get a chance. I don't always take the time to step back and have a look. So, yeah, it's looking pretty snazzy. So thus far, actually you want to do a quick creeper check, make sure. Oh, we got a cosmic raid. Awesome. Thank you so much, cosmic. Make sure everyone gets in past the uh, the ads there. So here we've got Hunter Triple Five coming in the HT5. Welcome, Dark Poet. Hello, hello, Shepherd. Good to see you. And we got True Purple as well. Cosmic Flower Power. Oh, Hunter, subscribe. Nice. Thank you very much, Hunter. That's awesome. For three months in a row. Ooh, did you get a? You've been upgraded to the gold. Amazing. So good. Oh, and thank you very much for the the follow. Exotic Exotic Numi. Is it Numi or Nummy? It feels like it should, English-wise, it feels like it would be new me, but awesome. Welcome in, everyone. And then, uh, yeah, True Purple as well. Good to see you all. Thank you very much for popping by. And Lost Decoy Found. Oh, my goodness. Man-made. Good crowd. Thank you all. Welcome in. New me? Okay. Perfect. Hey, Rabelais. Welcome in. Thank you very much for the lurk. Um, since we've got a couple of new people here, um, hello there. My name is Steven ESC, a.k.a just even <laughs> and i also play minecraft on the citadel Mon citadel server with cosmic joel duggan alistair mcfly omegan townton and anna inferno awesome man mate thank you it's uh, it still feels like it's very much in the be in the humble beginnings but i'm uh, i'm happy with the way it's coming along I'm, I'm a little bit new to discord as well moon girl welcome to the chat good to see you the beginning of the stream with four thousand viewpoints is only 25k to get. <laughs> there you go. All right. Actually, now that we've had a pretty good uh, bunch of you come in, I would. I am happily happy to announce, or I shall happily announce, that my one-year Twitch anniversary is going to be on Sunday, May 23rd. And so on that day, I am going to reveal finally Minecraft Bingo. Get some fun. Some fun bits to the Minecraft bingo. Uh, I'm very excited to finally get a chance to share it all with you. Hey, Firepith, welcome. And um, I'll read you the the excerpt from the uh, the rules here. Just one sec. I uh, Actually, I'll read all the rules right now. Why don't we do it? It's, it's not going to be a live thing yet, but this is what it's going to be. So well, I'll just read the beginning part. It's pretty long. So Minecraft bingo. It ain't the bingo you're used to. There are no cards, there is no caller, there are no numbers, heck, there's not even a winner. There's just Steven losing. How Steven loses. There's currently a list of 12 bingo incidents, aka semi-frequent on-stream occurrences, and if six of these 12 things happen within a single stream, bingo, Steven loses. The game officially starts when the first incident occurs. This brings the word bingo up on the screen. Each of the next five incidents strikes a letter off until Steven loses. So, and then so, side note, there's only, oh, you're raining on my parade, Minecraft. Raining on my parade. And so, um, I have to be careful of creepers now. All right, let's do this. We're not afraid of any rain. So I, I lose, if I lose, and so if a bingo happens in one stream, um, in the first stream, I have to sacrifice a, a stair block into lava. And after the second bingo in a row, essentially two bingo streams in a row, I have to do the rest of the stream without my elytra. Sad face. After three bingos in a row, I can only eat chorus fruit for the rest of the, the stream, which means I'm going to get teleported every time I actually have to eat food. And then after the fourth bingo stream in a row, Steven has to quote unquote streak through the nether with no armor. And then after the fifth bingo in a row, I have to go into the nether and punch a zombie piglin. So... Yeah, so May 23rd, a Sunday morning, 10 
o'clock Atlantic, we're going to reveal, or we're going to start um, bingo. So uh, thank you very much for everyone in the community that helped me come up with these ideas. I <laughs> it's a lot of fun and I'm pretty pleased the way that all of these turned out. Hopefully it uh, ends up being as fun as it sounds like it will be. And of course, all of this amusement and fun will be at uh, yours truly expense. Let's just chuck some crumbs in the ground before we get started into this. Cool. Well, thank you all very, very much for coming. Oops, I have to switch my iPad back so I can actually see the chat coming in. Uh, oops, I missed some of the chat. Pardon me, pardon me, pardon me. Hugs and cookies, yes, hugs and cookies for all. Cool. There's Minecraft. Okay, you're probably going to work that day? Oh, no worries. The, uh, you'll be there in spirit, Hunter, you'll be there in spirit. So, thank you all very much for, um, I guess, let's see, not entertaining me, but humoring me while I read those rules. I'll post them all, ah, why? That's one thing I'm not very good at is shooting and dodging at the same time. Ah, oh, get in there. Don't die. Sleep. So the entire list of... Oh, no worries, Cosmic. So the entire list of, I guess, things that will make it so Steven loses will be posted in the in my Discord. Um, the day of. Or possibly... Maybe the uh, maybe the stream before, so everyone can go in and have a look and just make sure that you're all well acquainted with those things that will get me in trouble. Or not get me in trouble, but will make me lose. So, yeah, looking forward to it. Oh, and that's one of them. Oh, this is a funny thing. So this look away thing, um, you can now customize the main the messages. So that's what I did. So that's actually one of the things that could trigger bingo because it happens semi-regularly and that, that there is one of the offenders. So then I may not notice it all the time. And if somebody notices me do something, that's one of the uh, the offending events, the incidents, then uh, you have to yell out bingo in the chat and then I'll get it started. All right, how's my inventory like? I have far more sandy things than I need. Let's put the sandy things away and get some stony things going. Oh yes, I don't, I don't think I showed it last time. So we'll go do a quick, um, a quick revisit back to the nether there. I mean, all kinds of stuff I don't need. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. All right, sorry, we're gonna take a bit of a detour. So, um, or chat, maybe you can help me out. Does anyone recall, did I show off the, uh, the improved Piglinda's surprise supplies? Anyone remember? Stones, no, anything. I don't think you did. Okay, so cool. Let's just go do that quickly. It'll take but a moment. So essentially, I had a piglin trading stall with um, owned and operated by the lovely pig Linda, but. Pig Linda surprise supplies, Pig Linda surprise supplies, Pig Linda surprise supplies, Pig Linda surprise supplies, Pig Linda surprise supplies. Oh my gosh, <laughs> I can't believe I actually got that. Challenge accepted and dominated. So Pig Linda surprise supplies is the Piglin trading booth we set up a while ago. The circuit was created by Firepith, which allowed gold to drop in and essentially Piglins would trade with you. But now we have four employees. We've got Leonard in there as well, Linus, and Lana. So we have the original Linda still there as well. So now this this is going to be um, expanded a little bit so they can have some breathing room. And so, you know, be kind to the employees. I just haven't figured out what I wanted it to look like yet. So, so yeah. But the nice thing is, check out, and uh, Firepith helped me improve the circuit up there so it goes four times as quickly. Watch this. So as soon as the fifth one goes, 
item gets thrown. So anyone here on the Citadel now that needs goods from Piglins can come here and they'll just throw everything your way. Pretty pleased with how that's working. And one more. And rip. Right. Oh, inventory's full. Sad face. Uh, you in there. You in there. You in there. Don't need those things right now. I'll sort that out later. Oh my gosh. Cool. So yeah. That is the new and improved Pig Linda's Surprise Supplies Trading Booth. Because it was good before, but um, if you needed a bunch of stuff, just it was good for a, kind of an AFK thing where you would just stand there and eventually your inventory would fill with stuff. But now that it's four times as fast, pretty good. HT5, lurking whilst uh, doing the last adulting bits of the day. Yep, wholeheartedly understand that. <laughs> Fair enough. Wait, so in this shopping experience, me experience, you want me to dodge things that are being thrown at me? Yeah, right. Sure, why not? Exactly. And Pig Linda is no longer lonely. So this side, um, what did I say I was going to do? I was going to build that platform out. Yeah, let's do that. Since that's what we said we were going to do. Um, I realized that I titled this video um, Tiling the, um, the Temple. So I'll go and build that upper platform there, then we'll come down and we'll tile it. Since the upper and lower areas do need to be tiled eventually. Eventually. Oh, you should say that three times, Moon Girl. I said it. I overdid it. I was not showing off. I, for some reason, my brain read say that five times. Oh, mountainside. I'm sorry. Not my intent. Ah, oh, can I get there? There we go. Okay, cool. Whoa, what was that? Oh, that's just a sheep. Paranoid much, Steven? A little bit. Okay, we'll take this out. And what I, I think I mentioned before, what I'm going to do with this is build a water feature into this eventually. Uh, so I don't want to necessarily fill it all in right now. So I'm going to, um... oh, I still have stairs there. Look at that. That's not, that's not how that's supposed to be. Oh, do I not? I don't have any extra room. What do I not need on me? The bone. Cool. So we'll do that. Oh, and I have something else that's not, I'm not going to be able to pick those up either. Gosh darn it. Oh, I also have... I'm testing a new... Um, what's it called? A uh, closed caption thing today. So um, beforehand, I had it in the bottom right-hand corner. It was sort of built in, overlaid right into the video. Um... So you had no choice but to see it, but I found another extension slash plugin, whatever they're called, that um, essentially allows um, you to choose whether you want it to show up or not. I don't know how well it's working uh, because I, I tested it on my side account, but didn't have a chance to um, actually explore it properly. So hopefully it's working for those who want it. Hey Jody, welcome to the chat. Lurk well in a work, in a work meeting. Naughty, but nice, welcome. <laughs> Living your best lurker life. Sun's going down. So we, we best be careful. Alright. So I don't know if anybody's able to... Even if somebody doesn't need the captions, if somebody doesn't mind checking it out, it should be on the right-hand side of the video. I believe you click on the little CC that's there if you hover over it. Um, I don't know how well that works on mobile devices. I guess that's one thing I should have checked, but I would like to make my videos more accessible. Or I should say, yeah, I guess more accessible. And while I can't, you know, afford actual legit closed captions, be whoa, Nelly. Okay. That's probably... Oh, 
okay to leave like that now that I think about it. Not offered on mobile? Or maybe it's not. Wait just one sec, I gotta check a thing. I'm just gonna make sure that it is actually active. Because it should be in a browser window, just doing its thing automatically. It is, okay, so this thing says it's working. It's capturing my words, is, but I don't know that it's actually, um, you see it on both? Okay. Cool, all right. Well, if it's working, that's awesome. That's what I wanted. Basically, there is an option for those who wish to use it, but then not necessarily always. Oh, I don't need gravel, that's why. Oops. Stop it, Steven. Cool, well, thank you very much for checking that, Shepard and Moon Girl. Double whoosh. I don't need the gravel on me right now. Gravel, cobblestone. You can go away. I won't be using... I don't need those... Let's put the iron boots in here. What are they? Soul speed? Yeah, that must have come from the trading. I didn't realize it. Okay. This should be good for now. Oh, wait. Time-wise, how are we doing? It is 5.51. All right, let's do a little bit of clearing down here because we'll need to go to bed shortly, so might as well steer clear. Huh. All right. I'm gonna have to look into that. I was admittedly looking into it on my, my test account, um, and I just set it up the same way on this account, so... Well, that's sort of disappointing. Um, let's do this instead then. Let's do... Um, yeah, I guess I'll just... I guess this one will go without capping today, which is too bad. Right, let's head back up. Give me one second, folks. Sorry, I just want to check one other thing. I'm curious to see if it actually shows up. Online. Yeah, on the right-hand side, there is a... Uh, curious to see if it actually shows up. A closed caption button. Online. Yeah, on the right-hand side, there is a... Uh, curious to see if it actually shows up. Oh, okay, so what you do, you have to actually click on it to uh, initiate it, to open yeah, it. On the right-hand side, there is a... Uh, um, and then there's a little CC oh, okay. within so that you, window. You have to actually Button. click on it. To, and now uh, I'm getting a repeat it because I'm playing it. So. Gotcha. Sorry for the echo there, folks. I forgot that that would come through on Discord. Welcome to Amateur Hour on Twitch. Let's take all this down. Of course, I don't need any of that. I just need to clear it out of the way. But since we don't need snow, we can just have fun and throw it away. So much Steven. That's right. And that's something I forgot to do as well. Oh, there is a new, new The Citadel Cafe podcast that came out today, actually. Um, Joel and I chatted about the um, Oh, right, that is a thing we need to take. That's what I was going to do, okay. I need to take all of this out and replace it with stone. I forgot that was the thing that I needed to do. Because all of this, so the, the top layer is going to be all brick, but from the bottom, it's all, all going to be stone. So last night, uh, Joel and I chatted about um, all of the, the Marvel goodies that are coming up soon. A lot of the movies. If you haven't seen it yet, Marvel released basically a 
a teaser slash trailer for all the the uh, Marvel things come mo actually all the Marvel movies coming up in the next little while. Oh yeah, <laughs> there's the saxophone, y'all. That would be another bingo item right there. So two things would have come up for the bingo challenge. That's actually two out of six required. So that dang, that's actually uh that might happen quicker than expected. Already we've done the um, Look Away and the Saxophone by Harris Heller. Oh, sorry, just one second there. I don't know. Oh, it's... Oh, I'm still... Sorry. Thank you. Or Moon Girl was just telling me that my screen wasn't showing and I wasn't sure what was going what was happening, but I was still on my uh my tinkering screen. Another item we should add, bingo, Steven doesn't realize he's still on the hold screen. <laughs> yeah, that'll do it. You know what, that's not a bad idea. Depend I guess I want to see how this feels as is. So that um, the uh, basically I've got 12 items can you see it now it should, it should be on the live full screen now um, basically I've got 12 items and now 13 so that's something I should definitely keep add to the list cosmic um if it's if bingo happens, you can see that. Yeah, okay, good, good. So for me, it's I don't want. I would like there to be a chance bingo could happen every stream, but if it seems like you know bingo happens within the first half hour of every stream, I may have to, to rethink it a little bit. Sorry for this shaking back and forth. Just trying to get it taken care of quickly. So even though it was on the hold screen, you didn't miss much. I was actually just clearing the snow. Well, that's the thing. We'll have to see. I am a little unsure. A lot of snowballs. Um... All right. Shovel shake in. That's right. We haven't done that in a while. Shake that shovel, shield, shield, shake that shovel, bow. Shake that shovel, shield, shield, shake that shovel, jump, bow. Oh yeah. Stegosaurus in there with subscribing with Prime again. Awesome. Two months. Thank you so much, Stegosaurus. Wholeheartedly appreciate it. That's amazing. Woohoo! The latest dance creed. That's right. Shake that shovel. Thank you so so much, Steg. Hunter and Stegosaurus in with the subscribe subscriptions today. Wholeheartedly appreciate it. This is one of those things that's going to be dangerous to do, but it's got to be done. Actually, let's... I don't feel like taking this all down while you're all here watching. Let's actually just build this. We'll build back and then I will take it down later. Since this needs to go back farther. Let's do the building on stream and the taking downing off stream. Taking downing is taking downing, technical term. Oops. Oh my gosh. Plus actually this will allow me to make space in my inventory. My woefully always filled inventory. In case I don't say it often enough, I you are all awesome and the fact that you all, like I keep saying, the fact that you all want to hang out with me is great, but then you, the fact that you're all just so generous on top of that blows my mind. Thank you so much. Yard sale? Did I miss something? Am I, am I supposed to do something? Oh, you've got the yard sale emote. That's right. Nice. So the yard sale on Discord, those made my day. <laughs> yeah, that's actually an. <laughs> Another thing that will trigger bingo, the yard sale. 
Actually, what the heck? I'll read them off now, because I like them. And it's talking about the bingo makes me excited. Just one sec. Uh, all right, we're switching over to Discord list to read again. So right now, the bingo incidents that can happen, there's one called Look Away. So Steven gets interrupted by the Look Away screen. And then another one's called Ore Blockhead, where Steven accidentally mines an ore block with my, basically with my Silk Touch pickaxe. So if I wanted to get coal from something, but I accidentally mine the entire block, that's a strike against me. If I say, where was I? Totally forget what I was doing. That's a strike. Yard sale, if I fall from a high place. One of them's called Aw Yeah, and that's the slow, he <laughs> hella, hella, sorry, slow Harris Heller saxophone song we just heard. Another one's called Busted. Steven accidentally breaks a tool and chanted with mending. Empty mug. Steven forgets to make a tea before the stream. Not this evening, y'all. I have a tea. Bad connection. Steven gets disconnected from the server or Twitch. The almighty yeet. Steven accidentally throws a weapon or a tool. Hangry. Steven completely runs out of food. All aghast. Steven gets hit by a gas projectile. Night owl. Steven tries to sleep, but someone else in the citadel beats him to it. So that one may actually happen frequently if there's someone else on. And now Cosmic has added the uh, the new one on there. Steven accidentally forgets. He's not. Basically, we'll have to make it... Um, um, Steven forgets that he's not on the live screen. Oh, here I am trying to be super quick, but... Oh. <laughs> All right. It's up to you whether you want to do it or not. That's hilarious. So 7,000. Hey, Alcorn, welcome. Uh, this has not been placed on Discord yet. This will be soon. This I, I have it on Discord because I, I shared it with a couple of people to find to see what they, they thought of it. And uh, apparently... The powers that be, the reviewers, all said, sounds good. So, so that's the way it's it's gonna be. Oops, I got the wrong screen open. Cool. So thus far, oh hi, Alcorn. Welcome, welcome. The mighty Alcorn shows up with a what's up, Chad? How y'all doing? You did it! The Icarus Clutch Hype. Nice. Alright. I need a sound for that. Okay, I need to go sleep first. Ooh. Oof. We are going to sleep, and then we are going to see what we can do. We've got three chai, three tries. Not three chais. Oh, now I wish I made a, wish I made a chai tea. Peppermint tea is still good, though. Oh, yes. We are going to do a, try to do a poll. Predictions, even. So, uh, I guess I was going to say, let's eat some food first, but I don't really need any food. Shall we? Let's do a prediction. Yeah, Xander's going to do... Xander asked about doing a prediction, yeah. So, yeah. Moon Girl just checking in to see if, uh, if with her viewpoint expenditure, can we do a prediction? All right. So, folks, I guess... Let's make the prediction. Um, will Steven... Um, will Steven successfully do the Icarus Clutch Challenge? Now, fair warning, the Icarus, with the Icarus Clutch Challenge, I get three tries to do it. So the question is, will I be able to complete it within three tries? Did you want to do that, Firepiff? Will Steven complete the Icarus Challenge within three tries? And while he's doing that, I will get the, uh, the bucket. The bucket at the ready. This is the wrong place. Oh, I ate food anyway. I wasn't supposed to do that. Well done. So I've not done. A, I don't think we've actually had a successful-ish prediction on here before. So let's see if we can do this. Getting ready here. So is the prediction live? I can't actually see it if it is. Ah, it's too long. One moment. No worries. I'll just have to stare at my beautiful face while I do extreme close-ups and drink tea. <laughs> Almost hangry. Almost hangry.
All right. Actually, while that's happening, let's go play some more tiles. So, Moongro, we haven't forgotten about you. We are just um, we're just getting getting ready for the moment. help free up some of the inventory as well prediction started all right folks get your predictions in so i think there's one minute to vote is there is that what it is fire pit do you have any more bricks more bricks cool so once the predictions are in We will. Two minutes, actually. Okay, so, so Moon Girl, if you're cool with being a little bit patient, then we will get this Icarus challenge underway. But, um, let's do stump. Yeah, we'll get it. We'll do it after the prediction. So in the meantime, oops. In the meantime, whoa, whoa, what? What's going on with the predictions? So many people want the yard. <laughs> so many people want the yard sale. It's funny. I can't actually see the numbers on here. <laughs> yard sale items are the best. True. Everyone just wants a deal. That's all. Oh, I thought I'd grab more cracked stone than that. And the story guys source has even to the prediction. Ooh. Nice. What happened to the cracked stone? I thought I had more than that. Uh do now, yoink. So I will have to go back to the other side and throw some regular stone brick in there. For the sake of evening things out. Alrighty, prediction is up. Cool. Worth is weight is worth it. Cool, cool. All right. So, oddly, in the interestingly, in the um, the mobile app chat, I can't see it. Thanks, Stegosaurus. <laughs> All right, y'all. Moon Girl, thank you so much for using your 15,000 15, viewpoints on the Icarus challenge. Um, yeah, where where I fly is fly above build height. Take my litcher off and drop to the ground. Hello, Anna Inferno, just in time for the Icarus challenge. I'm gonna fly up above build height, take off my litcher, drop to the ground and try to do a water clutch. So I need to find a flat area um, because I've dug all of this up. It's not exactly flat anymore. This should probably be a good spot. And I guess I'm just gonna have to keep an eye on my mini map as we go up. All right, cool. And we are loaded with uh, with blocks and things, so it should be good. All right, here we go. Everyone ready? Woot woot. Get your uh, yard sale emotes ready. We we're flying straight up. We are at 270 blocks, 280, 300. All right. Oh no. Hold on, folks. I gotta do this again. But my apologies. I didn't have a clear slot to put my elytra in, so I would have lost it. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Uh, let's put something away. So why do I have those boots on? I thought I'd get rid of those boots. Gosh darn it, boots. All right, there we go. That was a whole lot of wasted rockets just for nothing, but my apologies, my apologies. We'll get this, we'll get it. We are in the clearing again. All right, take number two. Huh, what's that about? All right, up over 200, up over 300. All right, a litter off. Water bucket in hand. 
Oh, yard sale. Yard sale. First try, unsuccessful. Bad attempt number one. <laughs> that emote is getting its use today. All right, let's do this again. Armor, boots, shield, uh, elytra. Where are my pants? Where are my pants? Okay, cool. Let's get ready again. Let's get the rockets in hand. I'm gonna waste so many rockets doing this. You heard it before it happened. <laughs> you can hear it here through the floor. Oops. No, let's not lose the torches. The beautiful torches. All right, folks. Attempt number two. Here we go. Moon girl. Thank you again for the points expenditure. Let's do this. Don't think that counts as wasting the rockets. Fair enough. Fair enough. All right, here we go. Oh, come on. What's going on? Twice. Twice. This is embarrassing. I used to get it fairly regularly, but this might be the second time in a row I don't get it at all. What's going on? What is going on? All right, now we've got a... This last one decides whether or not the... Uh... This it decides the prediction. Those are for practice, that's right, all right. Those are just, uh, we're just stretching it. Ooh, get some uh, leg workout in there, even though Legs, <laughs> leg workout won't do anything for a uh, for an elytra jump. But let's uh, let's get the rockets in hand again. Lucky number number seven. Where's the water? Oops. Where did the rockets go? Oh, there we go. All right, folks. Attempt number three. This is the decides all of the this, this decides the prediction right here. So let's uh, let's do this. I'm gonna try to do this for all of you who are believing in me. Oh, why does that happen? All right. Oh, yes! Successful Icarus Clutch Challenge, y'all! Nice. Got it, got it, got it. Woohoo! Thank you for everyone who believed in me. I accept this reward on all of those who helped me get to where I am. <laughs> I'm just going over here because it's bedtime. Nice. <laughs> Rigged. Cosmic. Somebody's bitter. <laughs> Woohoo! Nice. So that was like that, and thank you everyone. That was our first successful prediction, I believe. So thank you very much for setting that up, Fire Pith. Thank you everyone. It was good, totally. <laughs> what does that mean my own wife bet against me? Moon Girl. All right. Uh, yes, but thank you again, Moon Girl, for using your viewpoints on the Anchor's Clutch Challenge. That was, uh, that was a lot of fun. It's good. Oh, actually, now that we're doing this, let's, let's get into a safe spot so there are no creepers coming. Right back to the... <laughs> Hunter comes out of lurk for the challenge. I don't blame you. I don't blame you. All right, let's get this... Uh, get re-equipped with all the things. Put everything back to where it's supposed to be. Um, book touch. You. Bow. You. Uh, torches and food. Actually, torches aren't needed. We're gonna need stone bricks is what we need. Stone? Oh my goodness, do I not have any regular stone on me? Oh, I do, okay. 
but we're gonna need more stone than that. We've got so much andesite, we don't know what to do with it. So let's put some of that away and get some stone. Andesite, andesite. Yeah, let's just do that. So 4,100 points go to Stegosaurus and Shepard. Nice. So I had two of you betting in my favor. My gosh. <laughs> Gambling pays off. This is Stegosaurus. This is not a normal life lesson. It can pay off. <laughs> but it's not always the case. But congratulations to you all. And thank you all for participating in the prediction. That was fun. All right, so we'll continue this back. So, um, the family and I started watching a TV show called Shadow and Bo yeah, Shadow and Bone. It's pretty darn good. It's uh, it has some some elements that make me feel like it's almost kind of has this. Avatar The Last Airbender feel to it. Not in terms of like the comedic aspects of it, but um, people in it can actually affect the elements. It looks pretty darn cool. And so far the story is... Why am I over here? Weird. You always knew I'd get it. Thanks so much. Cool cat. <laughs> I'm not always cool, so when I am, I make sure I'm extra cool. Hey, Danny, welcome to the chat. You sadly just missed the, uh, the Icarus Clutch Challenge, where, I uh, don't mean to sound like a braggart, but I nailed it. So there was a, there were two yard sales, two, two uh, success, oh my goodness, can't even talk. Two successful yard sales, and then uh, one successful clutch. We got it. Right. So once we get this platform done, we will go and do... I was going to say go to the other side, but I believe the other side is taken care of completely because it is embedded in the mountain. But I will go and verify that. <laughs> I'm Good group in the chat tonight. I always love that. Mm. All right. I'm gonna have to make myself a. I wonder if it's worthwhile to just. I'm still a ways off. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Not to brag, but oh, what the heck? Let's brag. I don't mean to brag, but I am feeling braggadocious, which is just a great word, so. That's quicker. It's quicker, but I feel like I'm gonna mess it up. Okay, let's do this line straight back. I have a feeling that's going to... Wait, did I only hop up one? Yes, hopped up one, came down one. There we go, okay. So we'll continue this back. We'll make our outline first. Exactly, actually that would be a good clip. We don't need to have, we don't need to have all the clips be yard sales. We could have uh, these successful attempts as well. Nice. Oops. Put that there. And then we will go. We will go right this way until we hit that there wall. And once that's in, we'll know. We will know the area that needs to be filled. That is going to be a super dark pocket down there. I might have to do something about that. Oh, no, right. I am actually going to do something about that. That is going to be... Um, that is going to be opened up. Because I would like to have this... You'd be able to walk through into the back there. 
Yeah, that would be cool. If for no other reason to be a little bit quicker, I think. Let's get rid of the uh, this coal here. This coal is always good. Yeah. We like coal. Yes, we do. We like coal more than you. That's not possible. And we are out of out of stone again. Once you have the technique down, it's a lot faster. Also, it doesn't make my heart go into my. <laughs> well, that's the most important thing. It doesn't stress you out. We zoom back and forth. That was fun. Bed Wars players sprinting. It's Tuesday! Is it Tuesday already? Oh my goodness, who did that? Cosmic, thank you so much. Thank you so much for using your 2,000 viewpoints on Tuesday's Child. Oh my goodness. I am not ready with a timer today. There. Cool, alright. Thank you very much. We've got two minutes on the clock for It's Ikman, everyone. Hello! And so, yes, it's Thursday, Tuesday. Th it's Thursday. Thursday or Thursday. They both work in my handwritten book, so this is good. Oh, you know, I'm running up the stairs with only a partial belly full of bread. Let's take care of that. And I forgot to go get the stones I need in order to make my back hurt when I walk up the stairs. Love me a Tuesday is always good. Okay, where was my face going? Oh, he was following the rest of my body over here. That's right. So we take these. It's good. We don't need the snow. You get out of this backwards world. And no, be gone. Be gone, evil snowball spirit. That is better. Do I have enough stone? It will have to make do. Hunter is back. Ye be back. Hunter at 3 5. Hunter 5 5 5. Welcome back. Good to see you. Even though I am not seeing you. It is very convenient, Danny. It is the only way I know how to go about things. So if you have that as a problem, you should probably check with a medical specialist of some kind or a holistic doctor. If your face does not follow your body, you may want to think about the food choices you are making. We walk you back forth, place two at a time, we place blocks and doesn't have to rhyme. No sir. It's a chronic club, I bet it is. But I sometimes understand that, you know, like if you're doing window shopping, or unintentional window shopping, your legs want to keep going because you need to get someplace, but your eyes catch like onto something shiny in the windows, like some fancy boots with platinum buckles or something that make you go, oh wow, and your head stops and your legs keep going. I've had that happen. But you know, I, I did not seek medical advice like I advised. Oh, sorry. Okay, sorry. <laughs> We're over the two minute limit. I'm not even paying attention. So thank you very much. Cosmic for using your 2,000 points on Tuesday's Child. Always appreciated. Oh my gosh, it's now bedtime. We need to get down there. Can I make it? Oh, I made it. Sweet deal. Sorry, I saw there was a comment in there with a bit of laughter. Ha ha ha. I did not, uh... There are monsters in here. Oh, really? There, bedtime. Uh, I missed part of it. So the recommended food choice is baked potatoes 24-7? Actually, yes. And because I would like to make it a little bit extra unhealthy, double baked potatoes, y'all. If you haven't had double baked potatoes before, you're missing out because it's super delicious. Some light mob fighting before bed. Yeah, <laughs> that's right. Got to burn off that last little bit of nervous energy before hitting the pillow. 
before laying your head down to sleepy sleep. Exactly. Your door-to-door -door sales... Well, sales dead person tactics. Your timing's off. This dirt will have to be taken out at some point. Oh, thanks, Stegosaurus. Much appreciated. Now, you weren't here last time when I was talking about it, I don't think, but it was, uh... For the longest time, I was all about one type of stone. And it was after watching my sons play, and Joel play, and Alistair just went... Um, even Co Cosmic as well. There was a... Yeah, Cosmic's Garden, actually, was the thing that made me go... Yeah, I really need to, uh... Just get over myself and texturize it, because... What she was do doing on there looked cool. And then it was... Uh, and then I started paying attention to... You know, Joel's texturizing more, and then my sons and stuff. But it is, a, it is a good look, so thank you very much. We've got to pepper some andesite in and around here as well. Oops. It's one of those things that's funny that I had seen Joel do the texturizing in Alistair a bunch of times. Um, and my sons as well, but it wasn't until I saw a Cosmic Stream where... She was doing it. I went, yep, all right. Gotta do that. Cool, cool, cool. Uh, oh, really? Handful of blocks left. Well, fine. We'll just uh, pick it from right here. Wasn't my intent, but if you're not going to cooperate, we have ways to make you cooperate. I'm glad I did that. I can't have dirt in the build here. That's no good. Seven blocks short. Womp womp. Can't have dirt in the structure though. So that's good that we actually discovered that. Anyway. Cool, cool, cool. Yay, it's done. When you say good luck, you don't know why, but it gave me flashbacks to Terra Swoop Force and... Oh, it's a good look. Dr. Wolf's new look. Interesting. That's weird. I'm not sure why I hear a zombie. I do not like that. So let's go take that frame down. So that's Terra Force. It's Terra... Oh my goodness. Terra Swoop Force. That's something I haven't played in a while do that one of these days again. That was fun. And I have since gotten a little bit better with my Elytra than, than then, so it may actually go smoother than before. Oh, it was the stone version of the tree horse. The stone sheep, I see. <laughs> That's right. I'll have to leave it there. So I'm take this corner pillar down. It's funny, every time I come up this high and I can hear the wind blowing, it makes me nervous. Oh wait, I might actually, I think I have an extra name tag. Ooh, maybe we should officially make that stone sheep. That, that's kind of dirt sheep. Hmm. <laughs> I'm not sure though because I might be taking that part out in order to make the monument. My stone sheep, yeah. <laughs> I feel bad because if I name it, I may actually have to take it down because I'm going to, uh, still not done terraforming the mountain to make it fit in the way I want it to. So. Dirt. The dirt sheep is dirt cheap. get over here or oh, I know I can get over here but wasn't sure if I can get all the way up cool so we are 
it's officially in line with things here. And I believe this is okay. Rebelay is back with the unlurk. Rebelay is done with the adulting for the day. Okay, so this does go all the way back. Okay. So that level is actually taken care of. Cool. Because that platform now goes back as far as it's going to go. And this gets entirely embedded into the mountainside. Lord, yes. Completely done. Nice. This goes back as far as it can, I should say. So that's good. So let's do let's do the upper two levels now. Let's get all the platforms done. Woohoo! Sure, how much stone do I have on me? You know what? Since we're down here, let's go get, put some of these blocks aside and get more stone because we're, we're not actually doing any of the um, straight-up tiling at the moment. Uh, holy dirt. Holy dirt. Um, block. Okay, all the things that are not stone. All right, fine. It'll be like that. Yeah. Stop too early. We need to go up. Up and away. Or get back in lockdown too. And I wonder, I honestly wonder how long this is going to go on for. The whole lockdown thing. Oops. I'm truly grateful for uh, streaming. Actually, it's it's made me being stuck inside a lot more bearable. It's like it's it's my fun me time. I love it. And get a chance to hang out with y'all. Oops. We won't stop for that. We'll come back for your block. We'll come back for you. Lulid block realize they weren't coming back. Not for a very long time. It would be at least three Minecraft eons before Steven returned for the block. The block never forgave him. Of course there's always yard work that can be done. Our lawn's gonna get its first mow of the year this weekend. I'm falling behind. I think some vaccines are starting to reach a few people. Yeah. Yeah. This is like India, it's just so terrible. Oh, I guess I'm gonna take these down because they are directly in the way. Been mowing for about six weeks now. Wow. Sounds like some fine weather you have in there. Oh wait, this is not good. This is the upper level. I should be building Oh, I should be putting stone one level lower. Gosh darn it. Here I thought it was making good progress, but reality is. Fifty five Fahrenheit today. Is that good? It's wasted effort. I get too excited, y'all, too excited. I need to drop this down one block. Okay, this is the uppermost la uppermost layer of this platform. Let's get all this stuff, and then we will 
run down the stairs or fly downstairs before any baddies come out. Oh, geez, I'm being shot at already. Fantastico. I'm enjoying that weaving in and out a little bit too much. Monsters nearby. Where? Hopefully that's the only one. There we go. Oh, I left the door open. That was bad. Yeah, I hear you, Danny. I'm, I'm the same way. I'm, uh... Eager, but afraid at the same time. Second Pfizer shot in two weeks ago and Saturday would should be mostly protected now. That's good. That's awesome. Some colleagues of mine have been getting the AstraZeneca shot and they've been uh, zero side effects. Nice. My colleagues have been uh, describing the. Uh, the AstraZeneca hangover, they call it. That has been leaving every one of my uh, my work team has basically had to take uh, two days off. The day after and the one after that. And the same day, actually, they are uh, feeling pretty foggy-headed and had a hard time concentrating before the day was out. So, you know, part of me is eager to get the vaccine, but I'm also very, uh, the last number of times I've caught the cold, I've been like hit crazy hard. It's been, the cold takes me out for like a week or more. And the first three days have been like migraine city. So part of me wonders if this is going to be the same thing. Um, because I built it one level too high. Because this is 64 blocks high, and so the whole thing is supposed to be 64 total. And I wanted this to be two blocks thick, so I should have actually started one lower, one layer lower first. So sadly, I don't know of another way... I don't know of a quicker way to do a layer underneath this one without building, like... Yeah. I would have to build, like, weird scaffolding up underneath it and, and build it from the bottom, so this is just... Sad to have to start from scratch, but... Oh, it's all over the... Oops. Ouchie, ouchie. I didn't realize at first it was all up here. Oops. Oh, I forget that... <laughs> I totally forget that portal was still active. Thanks, portal. You've been swell. We don't need you no more. Exactly. Um, the inventory's full. Oh my goodness, my food level. The food level. Yeah. I hear you, Cosmic. That's, uh... I mean, it's going to suck no matter what if I get the, basically, the fever symptoms for the two days like everyone else has been getting it, but the... And I'm not, and I'm hoping it's just a posture thing, but I feel like I've been getting more headaches lately than usual. So I really don't need another reason for a headache. Weeks of recovery is not that much. But it's true. Ah! Well, that helped me clear out the side a little bit. Thanks, Creeper Dude. Terrifying as I was momentarily. I have to remember, you know, from watching Frostburn, I know that if a, sh a, a Creeper comes up to you, you can just use your shield. 
Um, but it still terrifies me. Uh, I'm not very confident with my... My instinct when I see creepers is to just run away. But it, you see him handle creepers in like uh, speed runs, like a boss. I just run, either run past them, no problem, or just like run right up to them, put up the shield, and then keep going. Like just doesn't even blink. It doesn't even phase him. Let's do build this out like that. Oops. Hello? Is that good? That is good. All right. Might as well build the. Oh my goodness, that is so not the part of the plan. Why wouldn't you bounce this way? Alright, get a little bit of a rhythm going here, but... That's better. Oh, why? Why, why, why? Double Y. That was actually, that was a triple Y. That was a triple level Y. Oh, we can actually sneak this under here. Good. Nice. Moon Girl is lurking. Lurking good. Maybe only to me, but I chuckle on the inside. I'm like cosmic, makes make myself laugh every once in a while. <laughs> I don't know that she does that all the time, but she did it on stream today. She liked this technique. I'm probably going to do the same technique on the other side. <laughs> Oh, right in my face. In your face, Steven. Oh, we made it to the corner again. Well placed. Well done. Good show and all that jazz. Jazz hands. Trying to be careful, I can't be careful. Because part of me is not in necessarily a huge rush to get the vaccine, not to go back to that all the time, but um, partially because I know the system, the people my age, they just open it up and this it's almost impossible to get a time slot right now. But also because I know I'm not going to work anytime soon. Why are you doing that? Who gave you the permission to go that high? Uh. Alright, sorry I missed that, Hunter. Um, thank you so much for stopping by, and thank you again for uh, renewing, uh, subscribing again for three months. Greatly appreciated. You're an awesome soul. Thank you so much for popping by. Oh my goodness. Oh, wow. I was not quick on the draw there. Woo. Danny in there with the Cheerio Hunter. Far classier than I. It's funny, I sort of like this song. But at the same time, it's like, it's not a very high energy song. Oh, I say that just as the song ends. Great timing, Steven. Great. Oops. <laughs> I 
totally thought I had food in my hand. Now I'm just placing blocks like a crazy person. Oh, that's why. That's why it didn't work, because I hit uh, cap locks last time, not shift. That is so not the same thing. Nice. Sweet. We've got the rim done. That's good. I'm going to do that over here now that I'm in the, uh, the mental mood for that, or the mental mode to get that done. I'll have to start over here. Right. Actually, let's go for a flight. Down over here. We'll swoop back and around. Oh, let's see. Can we do it? Or am I going to just... Is this suicidal? Oh, that was good. Whee! It's far more successful than I thought it would be. That was good. <laughs> Ain't it grand? Let's take care of that. Poof, just like that. First shot. I got it with the first shot. And then back up to the top we go, we go. Back up to the top we go. Alright, cool. This is what I should have been doing right from the beginning. That does not... Yeah, I know. It uh, seems to be more and more... More and more monsters nearby. I, I assumed it was a, a safe space because... You know, I could clo uh, close the door on it. But clearly, not necessarily the case. Hmm. We make it all the way if we can. Well... We reach and stretch and we make it this good. It's super good. Oh. Sour face. Maybe instead of being wasteful, we'll just go that way. Oh my goodness. Super frustrating. So, so far, there's been only one time that I haven't gotten Icarus Clutch Challenge in three tries. And that was on, not last stream, but the last stream I did it. Aldabar spent his 15,000 points on the Icarus Challenge, and it did not happen. So, at some point, I still need to figure out... Basically, I need to... One, in the t that's what I'll do. In the town of Hysteria, I will make... Or if not Asteria, somewhere else. Somewhere there's going to... Oh, that's actually... That's interesting because that's over too far. I think that's the case. Did I trim that off down there? I did not. That is over one too far. I need to make a mo uh, an Icarus monument or a wing monument or a bucket monument or something like that at some point commemorating and then somebody's and people's names are going to go on it those who save up their viewpoints because it does take a while to save up 15,000 viewpoints so we need to put a monument up commemorating those who were were willing to spend their hard earned points on Icarus Challenge so that it's just not it doesn't just get wasted Still slow and tedious, but I think it's going to be quicker in the long run than 
what I was doing before. Unless, I was gonna say, unless I run into the stone blocks, in which case, it's not. So far, we're still good. He's okay! So, did you, did you start earlier than usual, Cosmic? Or was it indeed Rabelais' imagination? <laughs> yeah, you gotta be careful of the words. Just my imagination? Was your stream just extremely long today, Cosmic? I mean, sheesh. a little over yes I was a little bit late today sometimes I just try to rush in to get everything done downstairs but I thought you know what let's get the dishes done and not try to, you know try not to break anything put the time into the chores that need to be done so not quite 10 minutes late but well cosmic that gets filed under self-deprecation So, much like the bingo challenge, Cosmic will be um, having various levels of punishment <laughs> um, when she puts herself down on stream. Putting down of yourself is not warranted. Yeah, slef deprecation is worse than self deprecation. Don't ever do that. <laughs> Sorry, Danny. The calm walk through the nether will be tough. Yes, exactly. Hello, real turtle. Welcome in. Good to see you. Good to see you indeed. How are you doing? In a little while. So maybe what I'll do for the uh, the Twitch anniversary, we'll do the bingo, and maybe for um, maybe for the uh, the affiliate anniversary or whatever I'm going to call that. Maybe we can get a live cam action into play here. I'm not even sure if that's something that people would be interested in. But I want to try to think of something special to do for the... Well, the bingo's going to be what's special for the one-year twitch anniversary on morning of Sunday, May 23rd. But the, uh, the affiliate, one-year affiliate anniversary, I'm not sure. Sorry, you're not on... St oh my goodness, no worries, turtle. Don't ever have to apologize. Always a pleasure when you stop by, but don't ever feel obligated. So anybody has any fun ideas for... Uh, fun and manageable ideas for the, the affiliate anniversary, that'd be cool. Oh wait, this is taking longer than usual. All right, let's finish this route. Because I forgot now that it's actually quicker to do two at a time. Sort of went into placing mode there. How's soccer going? Oh, interesting. TNT netherite exploration. That could be interesting. True, another P PvP event. Also not a bad idea. So that, uh, that, uh, 
the Citadel Cafe link that just came up, as I mentioned earlier, Joel and I actually recorded another episode. So if you t that URL, the bit the bit.ly slash TCC3309, if you change that to 402, that's the episode we recorded last night, which is live. And Joel just put it up right before my, not too long before my stream, so I uh, totally forgot to change it up. We'll get that rectified before Sunday stream. Yes, two at a time, much better. Oh, nice, well done, turtle. Undefeated is a nice feeling. We tend to be often undefeated on the younger teams I played on, but in the older teams, we weren't so great. <laughs> Not that we sucked, but it was just, uh, our team had this knack for playing to the level of the team we played against. So we would, we would, we played one of the lesser teams in the league. We ended up doing not great and would often lose. Whenever we'd play the best team in the league, we would do incredibly well and beat them a good number of times. Not every time, but. <laughs> Rebelly. Funny. Oh, wrong way. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. We need to get down here and go to bed. Pick up some stone. Long distance whoosh. Long distance whoosh. Slippy time. Alright. Oh, I gotta stretch. Shoulders being weird lately. Sipping some peppermint, peppermint, peppermint tea. I like the peppermint tea. It's pepperminty. So it's pepperminty, pepperminty. It's great. All right, need some potatoes in the belly. Oh yes, I was saying earlier, if you've not had double baked potatoes, you gotta do it. You bake the potato, you scoop out the insides, mash them up, put it back in the potato skin. It's still in the half potato shape. And then you bake that again. So good. The goodest. Mint tea is good. One of my favorites. Every once in a while, I feel like I could still use a caffeine kick in the morning, but I have been probably caffeine free, other than chocolate. Chocolate shall not be given up. It's not gonna happen. Um, it must be caffeine free for Probably not two months, but it must be close to a month. And I've come to discover, as I mentioned before, that I'm a huge fan of rooibos tea, where I was not in the past. Mint tea made the Turkish way. What is the Turkish way? I am, I am super intrigued now. If you guys did a build battle, that's interesting as well. Hmm. Roybus, yeah, it's a good one. You know, in the spirit of going caffeine free, we tried decaf tea, but you can just you can just taste the like the chemical caffeine decaffeination process. It's not good. That's a pretty good idea, though, Stegosaurus. One of these days, maybe we'll try to do a build bit challenge. Well, I know Joel has been talking about wanting to get uh, like doing some joint projects sometimes, and he's over in the medieval realm working on his stuff. Maybe an extra drawing. <laughs> touche, turtle. Touche. I do have uh, four more emotes to do. No, three more emotes to do. So I should definitely do that one of these days. Do -do -do -do. All right, we got two more rows of this. Uh, yes, two and a half more rows of this. But that last one will go pretty quickly because it's just... Wait, can I reach across? Not yet. We'll be able to do that soon. 
Fear zombie. Just oh, a bunch of zombies. Now that it's super dark down there, we're gonna have to be careful. Be extra careful now. Oh, there's a special kind of. Oh, <laughs> sorry, Danny. I forgot you were talking about tea again. Like, special kind of pot. Uh, is this PG-13? Oh, a pot for the tea. Right, right, right. Right. Uh, with really concentrated mint tea at the bottom section and boiling water on top. Oh, small amount of the mint tea is poured over. Preferred number of sugars. Cubes. Oh my goodness, that's that sounds amazing. It's not only you can gift gifted the sub to a channel you don't even remember watching. Interesting. I wonder if maybe um, you were watching one that you went. Uh, started lurking or whatever, and then there was a, a raid or something. But Danny, that sounds awesome. I mean, it's, it's, I mean, I'm a huge fan of tea anyway, but then having it, it basically uh, the experience built in and around the tea as well sounds like it'd be excellent. All the way out. Oosh. And all the way back in. Give me your fancy shovel. Oh, no fancy shovel. Ah. Heard another zombie. Thoughts on bubble tea? Um, I don't know that I've actually had bubble tea. Oh, sorry, Dan, I missed that. The weather in, was in the high 30s and the tea was piping hot. Wow. I don't know if the science behind it is true, but I've heard that having hot tea on a hot day can make you cool because it makes your body feel cooler having the hot beverage. So what is this bubble tea again? Is it, uh, what is the, what makes up the bubbles? I forget. Oh my goodness, I went down there. I did not even grab the stone. What in the heck was the point of that? Or boba? And so it, is boba a specific thing or is it like a specific plant or rice based or soy based or something? Chewing tap oh tapioca pearls. Interesting. Tapioca pearls are the bubbles, or is that they call it boba? Oh bad pun alert. And if you have a party, where are you having the tea? It's a boba fet. Don't try to fight it. I'm hilarious. <laughs> Shut up, Steven. I warned you. And I come up with the uh, the horrible pun earlier that if there is a Canadian version of Canadian strain of COVID, it should be called COVID nineteen A, but the A is spelt E H. Moon Girl and I kind of joked around with that one. I told it to Joel, Joel and he said, just no. I said, come on, that's hilarious. No. So COVID-19A has been denied by the Joel. doing for time here i realize i've been doing a whole lot of this oh my gosh it's after nine o'clock so we'll be done this once we're done this platform then we'll get to tiling like we said we would i guess all there is left to tile is the the bottom section on the north side and then to um 
with some of the normal blocks or normal stone brick blocks on the south side. I'm gonna try to get used to calling it that north side, south side, instead of the right side and left side. We're getting close, yeah. Oh, come on, Steven. At least I got all kinds of stone this time. Hopefully that is all we need. So, um, our family, as I mentioned, I mentioned it before, is a huge fan of the TV show Avatar The Last Airbender. There was supposed to be a Netflix live-action version of it, but I haven't heard anything on that in a long time. And I read an article that didn't have any... I couldn't find any substantiating evidence, but it sounded like almost the uh, the showrunners may have walked away from the project due to creative differences with Netflix. Which would be a shame, because that would have been... So the showrunners would have actually... They were the creators of the, the animated version, so... Hopefully it's not one of those things where, where Netflix goes, well, we've got the rights to it, so we're still going to do it, and then it's not right. Um, or hopefully that was just a uh, a rumor and not actual fact, because if they could do it right, a live-action version would be pretty cool. Well, hello there, mysterious block. I think I'm going to get this all done before this nighttime... Yeah, we can do this. Unless we run out of stone, then we won't do it. We're so close. Hopefully nothing just... Hopefully I'm far enough... Or close enough to all of the edges that nothing spawns up here and just kills me. That would be the most worst. The most worst. There's some proper English for you. Hmm. Might actually still be quicker to do it this way. Like working at nighttime, but we gotta get this done. We're on a deadline here, folks. We gotta get this done before the night is out. The worster. The most worst. The worster. The most worster. Alright. Let's see if there are any baddies near bed. Oh my gosh, look at all the creepers over there. Nice. They're all far enough away. <laughs> I gotta, oh, didn't notice that cosmic there. I got the eye roll. A well-deserved eye roll. It's a drowned in there, isn't there? Yep. And you, you armor enchanted jerk over there. I see you. Right in the forehead. There's a migraine for you. Skadoosh. Oh my goodness, over you. Super protective armor you've got there. Alright. Cool. So we've now finished off all of the platforms. So which means it's super dark under here now. <laughs> Let's run around here like a crazy person and take out a number of blocks. We're going to replace those with fixed stone blocks. Or regular stone blocks. No, st regular stone brick blocks. Yes. That is the English I was looking for. I believe 
Did I place them here? Did I? Interesting. All right. Um, I must have run out of regular arrows, which means I am on to my spectral arrows. Or maybe it was just using the spectral arrows automatically. Hmm. Put those. This is awesome of me. I know I put those bricks somewhere. There they are. 28 of them. Probably that's probably enough. Let's assume that's enough. Unless we check them away. <laughs> Excuse me. I've got to get better at the uh, the mute button to kind of cover up those sneezes. Enough. Oh my goodness, that was horrible placement. Thank you, Cosmo. And they've run out. I need to grab some more. Actually, do I have any in here? I do not. I do not. Let's check over here one more time to see if there be any. See if there be any. Stairs. Ah, running, running, running. Sweet deal. That's a sweet deal, folks. A sweet deal. And then I realized that just as I was doing this, I noticed I've got stone underneath all of the torches. So I'll have to take the torches down. Maybe I'll make those all. Of course, this is super dangerous. I'm not sure, not yet sure what I want the uh, lighting situation over here to be, but. As in, I'm not sure what I want to use. Part of me would like to use glowstone, not glowstone, um, what are they called, monument lantern thingies? But I know that that would be, let's actually hold a torch in our offhand, be a little bit smart about this for once. But I don't necessarily want to do something that will require like tons of tons of Addition and resources, I really want to be able to. I guess I don't want to spend tons of time getting the stuff. Unless, ugh, unless it is the actual, like the best, best look for this that I could find. Then I probably should just go and do it. And I'm going to do some evenly placed lighting in here. Not sure what it'll be. We'll figure it out. That is oh, all. Alright, let's uh, light this business back up. Because this is treacherous, y'all. Treacherous. Oh, I missed a torch in the middle there. Nice. Way to go, Steven. Cool. So there was one in the middle here. Oh, there it is. Cool. Oops. Oh, the offhand thing. I wish you could just use the item that's in the left hand. It always seems so finicky. Cool, all right, that's done. We're done tiling this side. That's good. Let's go do the other side. Let's figure out how much we want to take out and how much we want to tile. Since that was what the uh, title of the stream was. Oh, 
Oh my goodness. That, <laughs> that was almost a jump scare for me. That startled me. I guess now that we've created a super dark area up over there, yeah. There's badness waiting to happen. I can see a creeper creeping. Uh, let's get rid of this. I was trying to figure out whether I wanted to keep all of this or not, but... The lake's going to just have to go... Sand? What can we do with sand, though? Well, I guess I don't have an immediate need for sand, but... <laughs> uh, no tutor tutorial per se, Cosmic, but I do have a number of uh, VODs saved on YouTube. You can go check out exactly how I did this. It's, a, it's not exactly the most efficient farm, nor it is... It's actually, it's actually a pretty efficient farm. It's not the quickest to make, but... Jeez, that's hilarious. Cosmic, you're hilarious. <laughs> that's quite funny. Alright, I guess we're filling in this. Dear water, it's been great. Sadly, it is time. Thank you! I wouldn't, yeah, I went for, I went, <laughs> went for looks more than uh, over efficiency. Finally filling it all in. Bit of sad, oops, sad day, because I liked having it, but it's now just gotta go. Gotta get gone. Oh. Don't be dying of drowning when you're in two inches of water, Steven. Alright, is that good? That's good. So we gotta take that down. So this is all upper layer, so you should come out. Uh, let's just do. Do we have cracked stone on us? Is the question. No, because we put it all over here. So let's go get the stuff. Take a quick nap, and then we will tile in the water. Womp womp. Actually, maybe what I'll do is just place a bunch of sand and get rid of the water. Cracked, cracked, mossy, or oh, barely any mossy. Um, take another cracked, and go get the mossy. I feel like there should be some mossy. Oops. There it is. Some vea. But yeah, that's what we'll do is we'll, we'll dump all the sand. Dump all the sand in there to get rid of the water, and then that'll make it easier to get rid of the tile again. Boop on your nose. It's a friendly little boop, that's all that was. Alrighty, get some uh, some carbs in the belly. And then we'll get sand in hand. Uh, yeah. We'll just apply liberally. Alright, oops. 
Stone Crafters, it's time for me to head out. Well, Danny, thank you very much for popping by. It is always a pleasure. Hope you have yourself a wonderful rest of your day. Or, I guess, uh, yeah, rest of your day. And be back Sunday morning with some... Uh, I haven't decided what I'm doing for Sunday morning stream, whether it's going to be a, a drawing or Minecraft. Perhaps we'll head over to Cosmic's Good Time Zones to All, indeed. Maybe head back to Cosmic's Tree. I'm not entirely sure. Come on, you can do this, Steven. Hooray. All the hoorays, Steven. Well done. Pat self on back. Injure shoulder in process. Oh. Shows age. Talks in third person for an uncomfortably long time. There we go. Ooh, all the dirt up there. Cool, and now we can just spread a bunch of this goodness around. Oops, not there. this in the corner cool and like that through there and then oh, I do have some I don't know if my brain just forgot that I had them or what, or I didn't notice that they were there. But we're good, y'all. We got we got the goods. There and put that there for now. But the reality is, okay, we can clear this out. that we'll fill that in with tiles this is the last of the tile section the last of the definite section to be tiled is this still under this is under so this technically all this needs to be tiled as well which we can do let me finish this completely i think maybe the next thing we need to do is uh look at tapering that mountain Actually, one of the things I really need to do is figure out what the heck I'm doing under the stairs. I know I need to dig through, but it's like... It's almost like it's one of those things that I, I keep saying, that's future Steven's problem. Well, eventually future Steven is going to be present day Steven, so I need to have something figured out. This feels terrifying being back here. Yep, because there are baddies around. Of course there are. I was like, why can't I pick anything up? Full inventory, of course. Inventory full. Well, let's go put the sand somewhere because I have no need for the sand anymore and that will free up some slots. Put all the sandy goodness in here! Hooray! Run and jump, run and jump. I do not like the sound of that. I can't see them. 
Sometimes I find hearing them and not knowing where they are scarier than them actually coming at you. Should be one arrow. Sh oh, should be one arrow because you fell. Oh my goodness. Wasting all my weapons. It's a weapon. Yeah, I gotta deal with this all eventually because this, this darkness down here, not digging it. Uh, that was too low. There you go. Second shot. Alright. Place these in. As per usual, we'll speckle around the mossy ones first. I don't know why that is the as per usual. That just seems to be the, the order in which my brain likes to do things. And now we are out of the mossy ones. We'll have to go into something else. Crackstone. We're out of the crackstone now. <laughs> so we'll go to the regular. Oh, good day. Might as well do regular until the regular's gone. And now the regular's gone. We gotta go load up, y'all. Alright. Let's take a wee bit of a breather out here. I'm gonna do this. So I can see things coming at me. I okay, know what I'll do is I'll do this. So things can come at me from from down there. No, we'll do this. So I can look at your lovely faces while I set my tea. I have to stretch a tiny bit because my shoulder is being weird. Sorry about this. It's not going to be a long break. It's just... I feel like... Oh, more and more I've, I've been thinking about a standing desk a lot. And, uh... Yeah, I'm... The more I think about it, the more I go, yeah, that's going to be awesome when I get it. So I'm still, uh, it's on my list of things to get. And uh, through the generosity of the folks here on Twitch and Patreon, I should be close to being able to get them soon, which is awesome. Super grateful for that. Some mossy, mossy effect. Oh, wait, I was like, why can't I pick anything else up? I have stuff I don't need, that would be why. Um, and then, right, you can go in there. Some dirt, we'll just go place in the ground before I forget about it, because there's always a spot to put dirt. Even if I don't know how to place it properly. Cool. And then I actually don't know if I have any of the regular stone brick blocks anymore. Oh, there are nine of them. That's good. Just checking to see what I've got before I start making more. All right, cool, 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 cool. And it's been a while, I forget. It's as simple as that. It's as simple as that. Can do that again. Eat them. Good, we got... Okay, we've got two stacks of each. Sad face. Oops. Right there, right there. Great. Super good. Fantastico. Is it really bedtime? What am I doing out here? Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh.
But anyway, I basically injure myself every time I get out of bed. Oh, of course, that time I didn't. I'm not sure why. Is that a burning skeleton? It is. I love burning skeletons. Because they just... Sometimes just plain old drop arrows for you. And they did! Hooray! Thanks, Skelly. You're great. Ooh. Need to explore that after. Need to explore all the caves eventually. All the caves. How are we doing for time? It is... Well, we've got 22 minutes left in this, this here stream, y'all. Shaping of the land. Sometimes you just gotta dig back some. And this one. Yeah, we'll do that. Oops. You two snuck in there, I didn't see that. dig straight through now that we don't have any water to worry about. We made landfall to the other side. Fantastic. Long overdue. Uniting the two worlds. Alright, so this is all tiled in. This looks pretty good. I think I'm going to have this... That facade. Facade looks too sort of flat to me, so I'm probably going to start up there and, and taper down. I, I have... I do like the idea of being able to get through, but... I don't know. i got to figure it out. need to figure out a way to get light in here. Probably I could put glass in there, but just because this is such a heavy stone structure, I don't feel glass is appropriate. Tiredness kicking in, so just going to chill and lurk. Oh my goodness, Cosmic, no worries. And don't take this the wrong way, please, because I know it might, it's hard to say sometimes, but, you know, honestly, feel free to not be here if you need to get some sleep. And I always appreciate you, Cosmic, you being here and all that you do, but holy smokes. It is late there. You should get some sleep. Let's try to figure out what I want to do next. So we tiled the bottom there. Actually, let's just start. Let's deal with this wall over here. Um, yeah, let's just do that. I'm going to totally regret this because this is where all the baddies seem to be hanging out. I know you're not, and uh, from what you've told us, I know you're not always the best at going to bed. Or not always able to sleep, so if you got tiredness kicking in, maybe you should take advantage of that and actually uh, do your body a solid and get some, some shut-eye. chasm but give the space a little bit more reachable maybe what I'll do is I'll just do a tunnel through there or would it be worthwhile flooding this entire area making like a lake back here that could be kind of neat Maybe there could be an entire lake back here that comes through. Maybe like a little tunnel that would allow the water through everything. Or maybe I could take out this section here so that the water continues along. Oops, that was uh, so not the plan. And it is so extra dark in here. Not digging that. It's like an invitation to get injured. Let's 
go back up to where I was. Alright, let's actually do the other thing that's smart that I don't always do. Light in hand. Oh, so nice. How am I not able to pick up stones? Oh, snow, that's why. Who needs snow? So if I want to tape to this back, I almost kind of need to... So that's the bottom layer. Go back a couple layers here. sort of doing this, making this up as I go along. I don't know how that would good this will look. I'll do that. Put that back in. I'll do this. Push this leave. See if I can mimic what I did on the other side from memory as best as possible. So we'll need to come down bit by bit. It won't be as, like, basically it'll be a bit steep still, but not as crazy steep as it was before. Like, seriously, what do I have on me that I keep? flint either. No. Actually, I'd rather have a flint over rotten flesh. This is good. Bring that down one more, I think. And I was going to say, let's... Well, let's start to leave that. Hole is going to change our plans drastically. We have a bunch of holes we then need to fill. Cool. Thanks, Cole. You've been great. But now, we need to fill it all in. Fire pit with the unlurk. Welcome back. Welcome back. Wait, wait. Do I already have a stack of coal? Dang. Sufficient, as in that's efficient. Um, not a whole lot. Got all the um, lower level tiled in, which is pretty cool. Now I'm just tapering the side of the uh, inner mountain. Not a whole lot of time left in the uh, stream, about 14 minutes left. 14, 15 minutes. I'm just trying to figure out what I could do. Oh my goodness. A lot of creepers down there. Moon Girl is back with the Unlurk as well. Fire Pith and Moon Girl return in tandem. Welcome back. do I not need on me? Yeah, whatever. He's just flint. It's funny, I say it's just flint, but I'll probably want it at some point. It is dark in here, yeah, I know. It is close to nighttime, though. Thank you for the uh, reminder to... Oops. Keep an eye on that. Like 
this road and then I should get down there. Swoosh. Swooshy swoosh. Uh, I don't have any room on me for that right now, so we won't bother. We'll just, uh, we'll just take a nap and sip some tea because they seem to go hand in hand. Thank you very much for the tea, for the tea moment. It's already looking a wee bit better. Ah! There I am going. I'll be brave and put my shield up. Completely forgetting I'm not actually holding a shield right now. Amazing. I'm not so smart, y'all. Oh my goodness, I don't need this. I could have let it blow up the side of the mountain, I guess, but didn't feel like it. Not exactly the subtle landscaping I was thinking of, uh, of doing. I just trying. I know. I I I approve of its intentions, but not its methods. And sadly, creepers don't take no for an answer. So you just gotta say, "Oh, that's it." Sorry, it comes to this, but um, your life you sort of uh, you've ended it. some of these torches back in. Alright. I mean, this is... I, I never like doing this, but it seems like sometimes it's just a matter of walking around and placing light. Torches all over the place. Just to light the area up. Really don't like the way it looks. So I, got, I do have to figure out a better lighting plan, plan slash system than what I got on the go here. Oops. How much dirt is here? Am I going to regret trying to dig this all out? I feel like it's one of those things that probably goes essentially all the way through. We're good gravel to deal with. No, it's not terrible. Hmm. I have no room for anything. Let's just chuck the gold. Wait. Protection three and breaking three. Hmm. I need to get some diamond pants at some point. And mending. That's what I need. Pants that don't need to be mended. Okay, we'll get this road done. So what I should do is really take a sort of step back and take a look. See if what I'm doing is even along the lines of how I want it to look. Uh, it's looking a little bit tiered down still. Like, I guess that, that side's too flat. I need to... Yeah. I don't know. I'm not really sure how to tackle that one and have it look okay, you know? I wonder if we'd be better off at this point, spending the last little while. Let's, clear out. Let's start to clear it underneath here. Let's do it. 
All right, Stegosaurus, no worries at all. Thank you very much for popping by. Always good to have you here. So, um, yeah, take it easy, and we'll be back Sunday morning at 10 a.m. Atlantic. And thank you again for uh, resubscribing this month. You're awesome, Stegosaurus. You're awesome. Let's go put dirt over here. I know I've got a pile of it. No pun intended. Oops. Or... Hello? Okay, let's put the stone here for now because we've gathered a bunch of it that we do not need on our person at this moment. So we'll do that. Grab all these goods because I will need it to fill in the ground out there. I think I might as well go up and just grab the stuff if I've got room for it now. So we'll probably need, well, I will need some stone at some point to build out the, uh, the town of Asteria. So I'm not sure exactly what it's going to look like yet, but I know I will need some, uh, some good building blocks for that. So let's keep as much as we can for now. Now we're just going to swing this shovel like a madman. I was, I was, it's funny, I was consuming this like a madman, and then I was like, I thought I had something clever to say, and then I didn't. So my brain decided just to not say anything at all for an extended period of time. Until things got really awkward. Gosh, is Steven actually going to say anything ever again? We'll never know. Uh, Alright. Let's do this. Let's do bit by bit until we can actually see the, the stairs above. Then we'll know it's time to quit. As I said, I haven't decided what I want to do with the underside of the stairs yet, whether I want it to be sort of mirror the, um, the binary pattern. You're going to stream tomorrow night? Cool, cool. What, uh, what time? I think last time, uh, if I recall correctly, was uh, later than I was able to, to catch you, so. Or someone you said you streamed at, like, early, early morning? Is that what it was? 6 p.m. Pacific. p.m. Pacific. So 10 o'clock here. Okay. I will keep that in mind. Might be able to just catch a little bit of it at the beginning before bedtime, but that's uh, getting close to the bedtime here. Cool, though. It'll be my first Rabelay stream. Oh, OFC. Right, okay. So what, what time did you stream last time, Rabelais? Because I think you, if I remember correctly, you posted that you streamed. But it was something, yeah, you, oh, you did Tempest, okay, yeah. So that would have been two in the morning for us, so. Definitely not awake at that point. All right, that's some of the filler I put in there. Now I need to start being careful. Right, let's take out all the let's take out all the filler we put in. Just so we can see what the actual structure is that we created. Because we don't need filler now. This is when I wasn't really sure what I was going to do, but I wanted the structure to be sound. Yes, unfortunately, if that's the time that you start, it will be I will be catching maybe the earlier part of it than not. be rare we'll be able to catch an entire stream T 
Tis the way. Sadly, tis the way. Exactly. Alright, so that one... Was actually supposed to stay that way. Gosh darn it, Steven! Um, so that's supposed to stay... Like that. I still need to figure out these walls, so I'm not entirely sure how I want those to go. Oh, bedtime. Sleep in time. Silly oblate spheroider. <laughs> That's funny. Actually, I like the fact that this is looking starting to look nice and open. Yeah, that's gonna be weird in there, but it'll be good. Oh, I can see some light poking through there. Why is there light poking through there? Might be as far forward. Yeah, that's as. Actually, anything that's dirt we can take out. Because I did not build with dirt. And cobblestone is just filler, so that's not going to be a problem if I take that out. Ooh, that's probably. Yeah. Oh no, that's good. That is officially as far forward as I can go. Cool. Yeah, there's something pretty cool about seeing the uh, the underside of it. So maybe I'll have it, have it just like that. Let's go empty some of our supplies because we're full. Full, I say. Oops. Stone, stone. Um, yeah, that's it for you. Oops. And then dirt. I have no dirt. Specialty block? Oh my goodness. Okay. Cool. Right, I'm going to do a tiny bit more here because I'm kind of excited to see the underside of this belly. Or the underbelly of this thing. But we are at the 10 o'clock mark, so don't want to be too long doing this. Basically what I'll do is I'll just continue along tonight until I can't reach up anymore with just my pickaxe. It shouldn't take very long. Oops. Um. Cool. So, I mean, this is a bit of an interesting test in terms of the bingo for me as well. I was Part of me was worried about the, the bingo being too easy to accomplish every single night. I don't think six things happen. I think we hit four things. So I think it'll be fun. And I, because I think, you know, punching a piglin, a zombie piglin will be a funny thing to happen, but I don't want it to be a, a, a super easy thing to attain. Like, I feel like it's well, got to be one of those rare, joyous things. Like, you know, maybe after, you know, two dozen streams, suddenly everyone's like, OMG, Steven has to go punch a zombie piglin. Best Tuesday evening ever. Give you a moment, I'll get your popcorn ready. And I haven't decided yet, so I think I might do like the, uh, basically go as south as possible, down near, sort of near the main entrance to the, or the, the main nether hub. But 
then go north of that. And then maybe what I'll have to do is punch a zombie piglin and run all the way down to my, um, my, uh, warped mushroom. Lock myself into safety. How often do I go into a nether? The nether? Um, lately just seems to be possibly once a stream, I think. That's good. That's as high as we can go there. I could be wrong, but I mean, I've gone into the portal. I guess for the past week or so, I've gone in almost... Oops. I think I took out one I wasn't supposed to. Yeah. Actually, I was trying to get piglins in. That's right. That's why I was in there more often than not lately. Trying to pig, sorry, try to get piglins into Linda's Piglinda's surprise supplies. Surprise surprise. We're full of supplies. Alright, it's coming along, y'all, it's coming along. Actually, once I'm done this part, I'm going to stop digging straight up. One thing I'm going to do is uh, start at the top and work my way down. Because right now, I'm making it harder and harder for myself to get all of this stuff. But if I can go up to the top where the stairs are and sort of dig my way down, like do row, or sorry, uh, layer after layer on a diagonal that would be a lot better you know what i think i love the look of the underbelly of that well, it's, instead of putting I was, originally i was thinking i was going to have the walls flat but and put a bunch of filler in, in between but i think instead of all the filler i'm just going to leave it so you can see the entire shape of the stairs all the way up that's cool embrace the architecture The only downside of that, it means it's, you know, nothing's being supported by anything. So essentially there's that and that's it. So you think, think in terms of actual structure, this roadblock is just floating. There's nothing to it, which is a bit weird. But maybe what I'll do is I'll take that take out everything so it's, it's just the structure and then maybe what I'll do is put in just make it one thicker all the way up so that it's at least got some support underneath it all right I think that's cool so we're now just a little bit after 10 o'clock so that is uh that is the normal uh, time which this household goes you know what we should probably get going to bed let's just take a peek at how this is coming along though back up a wee bit it's quitting time that's right <laughs> it's like let's see what that upper platform looks like it looks a little bit structurally not so sound up there it's just attached by a bunch of bricks on the side and not even supported underneath excellent steven excellent okay, maybe what we'll do work is work on the uh, work on the upper pillars next time because we have plenty of upper pillars to do but they're going to need to go along the front in the same way, basically three along the front. But then, cool, thank you very much, Rebelly. And then so I'm gonna to need to do, yeah, three along the front and then three along the back, and then they're gonna continue all the way along the back as well. And then I'm gonna to need to figure out those back pillars as well. Cool, all right, nice, nice, nice. 
go into the open where we're probably not, hopefully, not going to get accosted by anyone. Well, everyone, thank you so, so much for visiting today. This humble, this humble stream called Streaming with Steven, where we um, successfully completed the the um, the Icarus Challenge, Icarus Clutch Challenge. Woot, woot. Congratulations to those of you who won some points through it. Thank you again to Stegosaurus and to Hunter Triple Five for resubscribing this month. Appreciate it so much. You guys are awesome. Y'all are awesome, I should say. I gotta drop that, guys. From my uh, my lingo. And uh, thank you to Exotic Numi for, for, for the follow. It's been a great evening. Thank you all very, very much. Igman did visit today. Yeah, there was a, a single Tuesday's child this earlier on, yeah. So thank you all very, very much. Have yourselves a good evening slash time of day wherever ye be. And like I said before, I will be back Sunday morning, 10 a.m. Have a good night, y'all, and thank you very much.